Hey guys, and welcome back to the Mercenaries. When we last left off, we were about to do the uh, King of Diamonds, I believe. Now, <clears throat> interestingly enough, knock knock, the artillery base is a heavily fortified complex built into the side of a mountain range. It's safe to say you won't be ringing a doorbell to get in. If it wasn't for the king being inside, I'd have recommended you pass on this one. Good luck. So, I think, whoops, I actually remember this from back in the day. Um, and if it is the one that I remember, this is probably our first challenge, shall we say. So, uh, let's head on down anyway. Yeah, because this base is huge. I mean, that could be just like my young, um, just teenage brain telling me that this was huge. Was I a teenager when I played this? I can't remember. I can't remember when this came out. This game came out in, ooh, was it 2005? No. Yeah, I would have been a teen teenager. So, I don't know. This is going to be interesting to replay. I remember it being a lot of fun, though. Lots of RPGs flying around, that kind of stuff. Okay, that was weird physics. But we like weird physics. And what the hell blew that up? I have no idea. And we're not going to poke that hornet's nest either. Ooh. There's explosions going on everywhere. Is that because of the artillery base? That's kind of interesting. Good thing this paper thin, ooh, this paper thin uh, armor on this fucking jeep that we've got saved us from those bullets. All right, what are we working with up here? Oh, we got a tank. Well, let's liberate the tank first because that seems like a pretty good place to start. Let's kill you, and we're gonna kill you, and you've got to die, and you are mine, sir. Thank you very much for your tank. Alright, let's roll deep. Now there's a phrase I haven't said for many years. Oh god, I remember that in school now. Yes, whenever we're going to go somewhere. Let's roll deep. Fuck's sake. Ah, memories. Anyway, let's go make some more memorable moments together by rolling this tank right into the heart of these uh, base up here. And just looking at it on the map, I don't think this is the, the one that I was thinking of. But, we shall see. Oh good. Oh good. We don't want support anyway. Alright, let's bring these towers down. Oof. Well, we have a North Korean vehicle. A pretty chunky one. Unfortunately, we're not disguised. Alright, let's bring these guard towers down first. Because that seems like a smart thing to do. Right, you're gone. Um, oh, fuck. Let's take this tank out. Right. Now, I don't know how much firepower we need to bring this gate down. But hopefully, a few well-placed tank shells will do the job. However... It is not looking like that is going to be the case. It is hard to tell though. Yeah, something blew up. Not sure if we can just. Oh, okay. Yep, we can destroy the gate. Good. All right, let's get our asses inside, boys. Move that carcass out of the way. Let's get rid of this Sam Jubrant. Because we don't want these guys peppering us. Now, is this... I think I remember this base, actually. But it's not the one I was thinking of. Let's level as much as this as we can. But we are rapidly running out of shells. There we go. Oh, God. We don't have the ammo to do this. Let's just bring down these... Really? It's because I moved backwards, Fiona. 
Um, yeah, we know, we know, we know. Right. Let's go destroy the spawn locations. And there might, if we're lucky, be some... Oh, that was our last shell. Damn it. Okay. Well, the tank's empty. Nothing we can do about that. Piss off, pal. Let's grab some gear. Let's go level this bloody spawning area over here. Yeah, they always seem to have RPGs up here, which is a problem. Which is a big problem. Now, one of those should, if we're lucky... Yeah. Yes. One of those will take it down. Good. Now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know, we know, we know, we know. Right, let's get rid of you. Let's take this out. We can use the two missiles in this thing. Oh, how many missiles are in this thing, actually? I don't know. Maybe we can block that. Uh, we can get in the weapon this side. Or we could, if, you know, this thing was further out of the way. There we go. Now, how many missiles are in this thing? Five. It's not great, actually. That kind of works. Yeah, kind of. Wasn't enough, though. Um, I don't think those missiles do a huge amount of damage. We're being jammed. Of course we are. Okay, well, we're going to have to do this the hard way. Oh, fuck. They've got, like, nasty things. Big, nasty grenade launchers. Recoilless ones. What sort of range does that have? Okay, it might be able to hit. Ow! <laughs> well, that was stupid. Um, hmm. Uh, right, let's go back here. Oh, dude, where do you keep coming from? Honestly. Have you been there this whole time? Probably. Right, if we got support options back online, let's drop in uh, vehicle ammo. And get this tank rolling again, shall we? There we go. Ah, right there. Is that good? That's good. Okay, yep, yeah, we know, we know. But as long as our ammo gets it, whoops. Come on. And another. Really? How strong is this building? How strong is that building? That is ridiculous. Okay. Um, we do have one more C4 left. Hey, buddy. Do you want to just, like, stand there next to that C4? Make sure no one, like, takes it or something? There we go. Beautiful. Let's grab this med kit whilst we're here. Thank you. And lovely, lovely. Can we destroy these barrels? We can. Nice. Okay, cool. Right, you can piss off, pal, because you shouldn't be able to get reinforced now. You can also die. And this tank, we should now be able to get back up and running. Although, the shells really don't last. Yeah, they shouldn't be able to back themselves up. I did think enemies came from these tents, but uh, maybe not. Right, give me the ammo. Give me the ammo. Ooh, 41 shells. That's not brilliant, but we'll take it. Let's see if we can... Be a cheeky little sod. Uh, I don't think that's... No. The trouble is the tanks aren't, um, like, super accurate. There is a little bit of uh, shakiness. At least this tank is, anyway. I don't know about the, the better, more modern ones. I like the RPGs. They've got horrible arcs on them. They kind of, like, fly off all over the place. Uh, is there any chance you're just going to, like, open for us? Uh, yes. Yes, there is, I guess. Cool. Right. Let's get rid of these RPG guys. Nice. Two shells. Does seem to be the magic number. Talk about coming in like a fucking tidal wave. More like a wrecking ball. Holy crap. Oh, okay. That hurts. That really hurts. Yep. Dude. 
Oh my god, that hurt. And we've got a helicopter up in the air. Can we knock it out? I don't think this... There we go. Oof. Okay. Right. Let's see if we can bring this bad boy down. Don't know how many shells this is going to take. A fuck ton, probably. And let's get rid of you, too. Shut your fucking noise, pal. Alrighty. Now, hopefully, just keep feeding shells into this thing, and it will eventually drop. Please. Because this is a bugger of a spawner. Like, literally just rolling out. Actually, what we could do, to make things a little bit easier, let's destroy that. Yeah, we're going to have to worry about the main building in a minute, I think. We need to take these guys out. Nice. Well, I mean, that's going to help. Is there any more vehicle ammo over here? Or do we have to order some more? be nice if there was some free stuff around. But then, of course, everybody likes free stuff. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get it. Unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be able to call in artillery. Or any support. Because there are so many, like, SAM sites around here. But, is that the jammer? That's the jammer. There we go. Nope, that's the wrong grenades. Let's use actual explosive grenades, shall we? Come on. Let's get all of those actual explosive grenades out. There we go. Beautiful. Cool. Alright, let's drop you. Let's drop you. What is that? That is another air-to-air -air missile. Doohickey, which we really don't want to trifle with. You're done. Do we have... We don't have any C4. We really don't want to pay for anything. Shouldn't have to pay for something. We're helping these guys out, like, big time. We are literally freeing their bloody city. In fact, the whole country. From these scum. Right, let's get grenades in there. I don't know how many grenades it's going to take. Is it? Okay. Yeah, so it takes about uh, about four grenades, I guess. Got some more ammo. Ammo is nice. You're dead. We could bunker bust that, I guess. Like, if we wanted to. Not really sure what the artillery is aiming at. But we might. Yeah, you can't actually kill these guys through the glass because you know it is the bulletproof variety now can we use this SAM launcher to actually do any damage nope come on or is it going to be I think it's going to be too high yeah okay so there is actually no hitbox for the turret which is a bit annoying Right, he's dead. We could, just to make this easier, get another supply of vehicle ammo. Which I think is what I'm going to do. Alright, fine, fine game, fine. We will get some more vehicle ammo and we will get back in our tank. It's actually not too expensive in all fairness, so... I guess it's not that bad. Hey, Our tank way. is quite battered, but it should have enough in it to outlast this. Special, Special delivery. delivery. Nice. Just what we wanted. Sick. I wish we had the co coaxial gun on this thing. He's gone. Because that would definitely make things a bit easier. Yeah, we good. Right, it should have no... Air support now, anyway. Let's bring that last bloody tower down. I think that's the last tower. Yeah, cool. Alright, you're done. All the artillery weapons have been destroyed. Good news. I've identified the King of Diamonds location for you. Thank you. Uh, however, where is he? Oh, okay. He's in a tank. How do we get him out of the tank? 
I actually have no idea. If we hit the tank. Oh, the tank's burning. Right, okay, cool. So, <laughs> that's really good to know. So, if you destroy his tank, he doesn't instantly die. Good. Hey, buddy. Where are you running? You were such a big man in your tank a minute ago. Now you're letting Jennifer just, like, beat you around. And just like that, your ass is ours. Your ass is mine. Call for extraction. Let's go. Roger, this is Expo two. I am in Good stuff. That oh, actually went pretty smoothly, to be honest. Right, Expo 2, could you not just, like, nuke yourself into next week? Because that was really annoying. And that cost me money. Luckily, these guys are, like, invincible. They always come back. I assume it's the same crew. At least I like to believe it's the same crew. The two idiots. And, excellent. excellent. We nice. You, of course, mean I should receive payment shortly. Nice. Hey, artillery bombardment. Not bad. Careful, guys. You might want to shut that door so he doesn't roll out. I'm just saying, okay? I gave him to you alive. Now, is there any goodies in here? Uh, I actually don't think so. But we can see if we can scavenge up some more supplies anyway. Go grab that. What else? No, we don't need to destroy tent. Oh, no, we can't get back up there, can we? God damn it. All right, well, I mean, we could, but not just yet. I mean, I guess, no, because that's civilian. I was going to say we could just jump in that and ride that up there, but nope, she is civilian. Um, so, the only thing we have left to do here is we've got the South Koreans and the Allies. Uh, South Koreans are going to be a tough nut to crack now. We could go do the Allies, I guess. Yeah, South Koreans are right there. South Koreans are technically closer. Um, so, right, this food needs to get to... Uh -huh. Can you make it there? 25 grand. Um, yes. Let's go see if we can make it. There's a lot of food in the back. It'd be a shame if uh, it all fell out the back of the van, wouldn't it? You know, because someone couldn't be bothered to actually shut the vehicle. Alright, that's fine. I'm just going to assume it's super glued down. That makes sense. And the way we need to go in... That's not even that far away. But I have a feeling... We've done fucked it up. Maybe. Right, right, right. Put your brakes on. Put your... Okay. Yeah, this is fine. Everybody, this is fine. This is, this is how Amazon does it. This is just how Amazon does it, right? I have the proof. Come on. Come on. We're just, we're just a standard UPS delivery lorry. Okay. Um, we're not going to be able to drive through here, are we? They fucked us up. We're not going to be able to do it. The food is literally right here. But they're going to completely wall this area over in trees. Uh, okay. Um, that's fine. No, that's not fine. I guess it's not that important. <laughs> it's fine. Fuck it. We don't care. Challenge cancelled. That's right. Um, now, how do we get out of here? Have I fucked us too? No. Okay, so we can get through there. But the Well, I mean, guys, if you're starving... There is a big shipment of food back there. Okay, I'm just saying. Technically, we did do the thing. And the Koreans really hate us. Like, really hate us. Now, guys, there's been a bit of a misunderstanding. Um, 
a little bit of a misunderstanding. Ooh, but that is not a misunderstanding. Yes. That will make them like us a little bit. Be nice if there was a couple more of those. Just to sweeten the deal. Just a little bit. It doesn't look like we're going to find any. But now we've found that, I'm going to save it. That way it's saved. And we have it. It's in the bank. Now, <sighs> these Koreans. Um, excuse me, pal. How do we make them like us again? I know you can bribe them. I just can't remember how. Uh, hmm. Yeah, don't know how. Uh, maybe we actually have to get to them and uh, like walk up to the front door, I guess, and say like, "Hey, bud, look, I know I killed a lot of you dudes and ruined your plans and probably killed, uh, you know, civilians and all sorts, but." kind of need to work for you guys you need to trust me and you know what makes trust happen in this world money right well I mean there's a load of med kits back there that we left that civilian I hope he's not too mad that we've just taken his truck in theory he's just dropped all those supplies off there for somebody that needs them and he wasn't loading those supplies onto the truck because otherwise we'd be a bit of a dick penis. Right. Uh, hey guys, look. Can I just give you a wedge of money? Oh. That was expensive. A hundred thousand. Mm -hmm. Listen to me, damn it. You get any more of my men killed, and you won't be able to set foot in Kusan without getting turned into hamburger. Are we clear? Good. Now then, if we don't find a way to slow the Chinese down, they'll take Pyongyang, and I'll have to fold. Mm -hmm. I need someone to drive down to Nampo and blow up their entire fuel depot. That means every truck, every tank, and that big refinery they've got. Yay, now we've got to piss off the Chinese. Um, <sighs> Fine. Excellent for use, yeah. <laughs> C-130. Right, what have we got? South Korean supply drop. Cool. Just what I need. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's going to be that simple. For a complicated mercenary. Um, I guess they got the tow launcher on this one. Okay, so complete objectives before reinforcements arrive. Okay, they, they don't want much, do they? I mean, seriously. Uh, quickest way. Yep, yeah, okay. Now, if we had a helicopter or something, that would probably make this a shit ton easier. But, do you know what we don't have? We don't have a helicopter or something. So, we're going to have to make do with this. Or at least, maybe something that we can, um, liberate when we get closer. I mean, there's a chance that we could get a helicopter because we're going to fly past the literal hornet's nest. But... Uh, I think it's going to take way too long to fiddle and fart around trying to get one. So we're just going to shoot on through. That'll do. That helicopter's trying to follow us and shoot us, which is cool, but, you know... It'd be better if you actually like, came down here and uh, <laughs> let me just take you over. That would be nice. But no, they're not going to do that because they're massive goits. So we're just going to fucking miss it over there. Look at these. We've got allied helicopters there. But I don't think they would really help us out in this situation. Because they're big, unwieldy, and they don't have the firepower that we need. I'm not sure how much firepower you need to pop one of those fuel. Uh, fuel. There is a depot 
depots, but... Yeah. The fuel truck should be driving around there. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know, we know, we know, we know, we know. Right, uh, man weapon. Okay, let's see if we can do this in time. That's one fuel truck down. Okay. Is that a fuel tank? A fuel truck? I don't know. There's another fuel truck over there. Nice. Okay. So we're kind of a little bit of the way there. So that's two out of ten. We're 20%. We're just going to keep driving our death wagon around. And hopefully... Oh. Oh, you sneaky little sausages. Those fuel tanks that are driving around there. Do we actually need to destroy those? We do. Okay, but dude, please, please don't be too salty about this, guys. Okay, I don't want to do this. I'm being made to do this. Okay, there's a difference. All right, money is making me do this. Okay, ho! Right, he's gonna go that way. Let's see if we can kind of volley a missile at him. Nice. Now. Oh, another one. Come to daddy. Oh, yep. That was bad. Now, if we fire this missile down here. No, that didn't hit anything. That was not good. The guys, please. Okay, look, 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 look. You could be making this so much easier for me. All right. I'm already feeling pretty bad about the whole thing. Like, really bad. You don't have to get mega salty about it. And make me feel even worse. I mean... Oof. There's probably some very nice chaps driving these uh, fuel tanks. That probably don't need to be murdered. Oh, there's another fuel tank there. This is a really bad time to be a fuel tank dude. I'm just saying... Right. Yeah, the Chinese really hate us now. Uh, oh, hello. Can you stop driving your vehicle, please? Hello. I hate to do this. I do. Oh, there's two of them. I hate to do this, guys. I really do. Okay. There was another way. Yeah, it's getting very hot down here. In fact, these Chinese fellows really aren't happy with me at all. There's a lot of fuel tanks here. So, we actually could have... Um, oh, wait. Hang on. Still got to destroy that. I was going to say, we could. Yeah, we could actually have done that uh, a little bit better without pissing so many of them off. But now the Chinese absolutely hate us. We've only made a slight profit from that stealth fighter attack. Okay. Yeah, let's get out of here before they, like, you know, <laughs> really lose their patience with us. Cool. Alright, nice. And I think we're just about done here. We're definitely going to have to butter these guys up again. I don't really... Yeah, he's really angry. I think I killed his friend. Which would be bad. Um, for everyone involved. Apart from me. Well, maybe me. I do feel a little bit bad. Let's just go hide down here. Um, you guys going to be okay? You sure you don't mind the fact that I've just ruined everything? Uh, yeah, there, there's no way, really, of us keeping everybody happy at the same time. I mean, China's really <laughs> unfriendly now. South Korea's a little bit better. I mean, they're unfriendly, but they're not instantly shooting us on sight, which is good. Um, 
The Americans are just sitting back and enjoying the show, which is about right, I suppose. Yeah, they're... Um, look, dude, look, I hate to do this, okay? I do, okay? But I need this. I really need this vehicle. Oh, do I have to kill you? Oh, I don't want to kill you. No, and I've just thrown the wrong grenade. That's the grenade I want. Bugger. Okay. Let's get a vehicle that's, like, unmanned. Because we really don't want to make things worse than we have to. Oh, God. We've got, like... <laughs> we've got American helicopters, like, turning up. I don't know if they're going to go hose those guys down or what. But, hey, it's cool. Right. Nice. Right, let's get out of here. Outside of Chinese territory once more. Um... Let's go this way. I think this is the way. Yep. It's the long way. And when we come back, guys, uh, we are going to hopefully um, not piss the Chinese off much more. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I think we're probably going to make them very angry with us. Uh, <laughs> but... That's the way it is. So the South Koreans and the Chinese are at each other. That seems fairly uh, obvious. But then the Russians don't exactly like the South Koreans either. Oh boy. I think the South Koreans are going to be like the hardest set to keep happy. I think. But we, 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 we've made a lot of, uh, a lot of enemies here. And I do get the feeling that I'm going to have to pay out another 100,000. Which, I suppose, when you think about it, doesn't seem too much money. Uh, to make everybody love us again. And if we have to keep doing that, that's going to get really expensive. Yep, we will clear up all the number cards uh, later on. Let's get out here and get some health. And now I'm going to wrap this video up. So thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.